team coverage of that storm damage continues in the upstate. Want to send things out now to Ray Lorena, who joins us live in Anderson. Ray, you've seen a lot out there. Yeah, we have Chris, and we're just outside the home of Anderson's mayor along North Avenue. And you can see this is what looks to be some sort of clamp, and this is just some of the debris that this massive tree behind me has left behind after it fell outside of his house. And you can see this massive tree, this trunk, it has to be at least six, eight feet up above uh, my tall head. And, you know, this tree fell on top of those power lines and you can just see the damage of all the wood splintering on top of the bush and we just saw the mayor as he was coming back home and he said he was grateful that this tree fell on the road and not on his house. Now this line of storms moved across the upstate early this morning and the storms knocked down trees and power lines. Earlier today Duke Energy was reporting more than 20,000 power outages just in Anderson County. And Mayor Terrence Roberts said people were seeing damage similar to his across the city. Downtown, just all over the, the central business district and into the residents, you know. I mean, our guys here are doing um, public works or working the best they can to get trees out of the middle of the roads so people can go to and from businesses and homes and so forth. Tonight, Duke Energy crews are working to restore power to thousands in Anderson County and the upstate, and the National Weather Service will be inspecting damage in several places across the area. And throughout the day, we have seen several line trucks coming in and out trying to restore power to this neighborhood. Live in Anderson, Ray Arena, WIFF News 4.